Hello guys, it's Mark, aka the Drunk Bunny, back with you again today for another uh, quick video. Um, today's going to be a quick unboxing. Um, I have actually already opened up this box, um, but anyway, because uh, I wanted to get into it, I didn't have time to film at the time that I was opening it. So, way back in November of 2017, last year, I pre-ordered the new Fratellis album. Um, the Fratellis are a Scottish uh, indie rock slash, um, I, I would just call them rock and roll. I don't know exactly what genre they fall into, but um, they're a band that I have gotten into fairly recently. Um, I listened to their stuff actually while I was growing up because their song Chelsea Dagger uh, is the Chicago Blackhawks goal song. Um, and I love that song. So I actually listened to their first album, uh, Costello Music, which I actually now own on CD. Um, I listened to that album quite a bit, but I didn't really get into the, their uh, other albums till like the last year. Um, I heard the lead single off of their new album, In Your Own Sweet Time, um, last November, and I loved it, so I pre-ordered the album. I have it on three different formats right here. Um... And I also have something uh, extra special in this package as well. Something that I'm very excited about that's going to be a gem of my music collection. For sure. So today I thought I'd just go through what came in the package. Um, it came in this box here. Um, pretty well packaged. Came all the way from the UK. Um, because obviously they're Scottish. So they, um, they don't. Uh, apparently they don't have like a store in the United States. It's like an international thing and they're, they ship out of the UK. So it did take a while. The album came out March 16th and it is March, it was March 25th when I picked this up in the mail. So it took about nine days. Um, that's not a huge deal though. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and just get into what um, I picked up here. We're going to start with the album on cassette. Um, yes, they sell cassette tapes now. Um, cassettes are making a, uh, big revival, I think. I have a feeling, like, what's happening with vinyl now is gonna happen with cassettes as well, uh, mm -hmm. within mm -hmm. the next couple of years. I know lots of record stores are selling cassettes again. Um, they're, they're really great because they have that analog, uh, sound that you get from vinyl, but they're really small, they're really cheap, and they're portable, um, which makes it really, really good. So there's a track list there. Um, there's a lot of glare. I'm pretty sure you're not going to be able to read it. But anyway, that is the track list. And then you can see the tape inside. This is obviously from 2018 on Cooking, Cooking Vinyl Records. So you open it up. You got the cassette tape. A nice white cassette tape there. Real nice. Side A and side B. The only thing I don't like about cassettes is that you have to rewind them. That's a little bit annoying. But anyway, this is just like a like a card. Um, it's not actually like a fold-out booklet or anything, but it does have credits and it has a little drawing um, on the inside there. So anyway, um, this came in the in the package. Um, otherwise, I probably wouldn't have ordered it on cassette because. I like cassettes, they're just not, I'm just, I don't have a very big collection of them. But anyway, um, there's the album on cassette. Let me actually look, because I did get a sheet here that told me, like, how much everything was, um, like, individually. So the cassette's, like, eight bucks. Um, that's the cheapest. The CD would have been 12-something, and the vinyl, 27. So, and then the extra thing I got for free, because I ordered in the, in the bundle. So we're going to save that for uh, second to last here. Let the suspense grow. Alright, so here's the album on CD. I do love the cover art. I'm not a big fan of the artwork that they put like in the booklet itself. Um, it's pretty plain, but the artwork, the cover art is really, really cool, in my opinion. That kind of kaleidoscope thing in the background, and some sort of demon lover thing there, which is pretty cool. As you can see, the the chick has a tail. <laughs> I don't know what, the, I guess that's supposed to symbolize a demon. I don't know. Anyway, 
uh, the Fratellis in your own sweet time. The track list. Maybe you might be able to actually read that one. I don't know, camera's a little blurry. Anyway. Disc art, very plain. This is a nice digi pack though. And there's the booklet here. Just basically lyrics on orange paper. Basically all it is. And then there is that little drawing on the back there. Alright, so there's a CD copy. Now for my little special extra here, because I ordered in the bundle. I got this really awesome, and it might be hard to pick up on camera. You can kind of see it there. Hand-signed print. This is hand-signed by all three members of the band. Um, I can't tell you exactly whose signature is whose. Um, they go by uh, Fratelli, so all of their last names are Fratelli. That's not like their birth name or anything. They're not brothers, but there are stage names. So there's John Fratelli, there's Barry Fratelli, and who's the last guy's name? I forgot. Anyway, um, is it Mints? I think it's Mints. Yeah, because I think I can kind of make it out. That one, it looks like there's a B right there, so that's probably Barry. I think that one looks like Mints, and that's probably John Fratelli, who's the lead singer, and that's probably his signature. But this is just so cool. Like, I don't have anything signed in my collection, so this is really awesome. I'm going to get me a frame for this. Um, they call it a signed print. It's really like a postcard. Um, it's very small, but uh, still very cool. Yeah, I don't have anything, like I said, hand signed, so that's really awesome. That's going to be a treasured piece of my collection. All right, and now we have the vinyl, what we've all been waiting for. So there's the cover in all its glory. The hype sticker there. It says, uh, the Fratellis in your own sweet time. Includes a single stand-up tragedy. Uh, limited edition heavyweight vinyl. Includes download card. So it says heavyweight vinyl. I don't know if it's 180 gram or not. Um, it feels very heavy. It feels like a 180 gram record, but I don't know if, if it's exactly 180 gram because it doesn't say. But anyway, um, there's the back. And if this download is transferable, I am going to give it away to whoever gets it first. Um, let's see if the camera can focus on anything. I don't know. It looks very blurry. Hopefully you could pick that up. Anyway, if not, oh well. <laughs> Alright. So let's get to the record here. This is the sleeve. There's no inserts or anything. It's just the sleeve. It has the lyrics on it. Very sturdy sleeve. And that little drawing in the back. I'm not really going to tell you anything about the album itself because uh, I'm going to do a review. So I'm going to save my thoughts for the review. Alright, so this, they said orange. This looks a little bit like a transparent gold to me. Uh, I didn't expect it to be transparent, but it is just a beautiful record. There's side A right there. And side B. Yeah, just a beautiful, beautiful record. It's, I mean, it looks more orange than gold, but it is very transparent. So yeah, beautiful, beautiful record. Anyway, um, that's going to be it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed a uh, short little unboxing video. Stay tuned for my review um, of the album. I'm very busy with school and stuff. So it may be a little while, um, but I want to review that album, and I also want to review Jack White's new album, uh, Boarding House Reach, that just came out this past weekend. Um, so two really good albums come out or came out two uh, in back-to-back -back weeks. So I do want to review both of those, um, and I also have the Third Man Records Vault package 
uh, coming that has uh, Jack White's new album in it. So I'll be doing an unboxing of that as well. That's a really cool addition. Um, the reason I don't have that is because it came to my parents' house. It didn't come to my dorm um, up here at school, so I don't have access to it. Um, it's already been delivered, but I just don't have access to it right now. Um, hopefully this weekend. So I'll be doing that unboxing and then a review following. So if you enjoyed this video, leave me a like. Uh, hit that subscribe button down below to stay tuned for future videos. Um, and yeah, have a great day. <laughs>